Welcome to Royal Secrets. When Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are in Canada, Scotland Yard officials say they are greeted like skivvies. Please don't forget the subscription button is available for you to turn it on. If you're not yet a member of this community, the pair, who are constantly being watched over by security, guards in their isolated hideout have claimed they feel like they are being treated like skivvies. Due to their rotor, they work for two weeks at a time, raising their compensation with overtime since they are on call 24-7. Day Davies, a former head of Royal Protection, stated, I would consider running errands and going shopping beyond the remit of the close protection personnel. Since close protection is their top goal, they must adhere to them like glue. However, you should establish a rapport with the employer and tackle these circumstances with common sense. The squad is accruing significant debt as they keep a close eye on the pair who have resigned from their position as frontline royals, spending a lot on flights, automobiles, salary, and overtime. One member of the royal protection team was observed purchasing food from Meghan and Harry's preferred organic delicatessen, located nearby their $10 million home. Around the couple and their nine-month old son Archie, a team of up to 15 highly trained close protection specialists, including some Canadian Mounties, are on duty. The number is more than previously stated, and the Duke and Duchess's stain.5 million five bedroom hideaway appears to be shared by the couple's security detail along with three other homes. Despite the fact that the men are glad to be working, a royal security source claimed last night that they sometimes feel as though they are only picking up groceries and takeout. They should be sticking to close protection alone as they are close protection police rather than conducting errands. It's risky for a number of reasons, not the least of which being that if something were to happen, it wouldn't be good if one of them was out running errands or getting coffee. And if they were in the wrong location at the wrong moment, their superiors would give them the cold shoulder. According to a local source, the officers had also been seen picking up orders from a Tim Hortons coffee and fast food location close by. According to the local source, the bodyguard's collection of vehicles, all Range Rovers, Land Rovers, and SUVs, must have been rented locally. There are 10 to 15 strong men, and the majority of them appear to be British. They are working really hard and professionally, yet it is difficult to miss them in a region this remote. The cop's comments came amid a dispute about who would pay for the protection of the Sussex, with a cost-sharing exercise between Britain and Canada being anticipated. The team's highly skilled British members met police detectives who may make up to sown 100,000 year, frequently switch between Britain and other countries. Additionally, at least four guards are typically present when Harry or Meghan travel. Harry and Meghan's spokeswoman declined to respond. He can imitate most individuals. He excels in accents of any kind. The Queen Consort also lauded her husband's role as a grandfather, admitting that the youngsters love him and appreciate the King's natural ability to make them laugh, which frequently entails him crawling on the ground with them and showing them things in the garden. Prince William and Kate, Princess of Wales' three children, Prince George, nine, Princess Charlotte, seven, and Prince Louis, Four, as well as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's two children, Archie Harrison, three, and Lilith Diana. One, give Charles a total of five grandkids. Bye-bye. See you next time. He can imitate most individuals. He excels in accents of any kind. The Queen Consort also lauded her husband's role as a grandfather, admitting that the youngsters love him and appreciate the King's natural ability to make them laugh which frequently entails him crawling on the ground with them and showing them things in the garden. Prince William and Kate, Princess of Wales' three children, Prince George IX, Princess Charlotte, seven, and Prince Louis, four, as well as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's two children, Archie Harrison three, and Lilith Diana, one, give Charles a total of five grandkids. Bye-bye. See you next time.